Welcome. Uh, I decided to make this video because I was picking up cooking in Wildstar and uh, there's a lot of discovery recipes you have to get for the uh, tech tree achievements for it. You have to get an original recipe and then you have to get the discovery offshoot recipes of that to get the achievements. And uh, I was looking for any guide or anything like that that would actually have the achievement uh, locations or the recipe discovery locations on it and I couldn't find any so I, I had a suspicion and I made sure that they're all in the same spot for every person because that was my first thought maybe they're random but they're not it looks like they are all indeed the same so some of the low-level ingredients especially the low-level ones even the high-level ones sometimes there's just certain ingredients that are really rare and trying to get the same discovery over and over can get incredibly expensive. So I figured as I was leveling it up, I would share all the discovery locations that I found with everybody and uh, I'll at least give an attempt at, uh, at landing each one of them. It's, it is sometimes random, but uh, I think for the most part these are all pretty easy, so I should be able to do it. But it will at least give you a location for it. Uh, I guess we'll start with the uh, the cooking one achievement, as would be the logical place to start. Uh, you will need the base recipe for the first one of the wings, and you'll also you'll need to discover these two recipes down here, which are the tangy wings and the hot wings. And uh, if you're unfamiliar with the cooking, it's uh, it, it can get kind of complicated, but this one's going to be pretty easy. We need the uh, stringy poultry to start the recipe. All you do is go to load schematic. I have one of that, but we'll just abandon that. Uh, load the schematic, and it brings up this uh, crafting circle. And basically, we have all these ingredients that we have to add to it. We start in the middle, and each ingredient, say this one's over to the right on the spicy side, so we open up our list of spicy ingredients. And if we add this ingredient, the pinch of cinnamon, it will move our target cursor from the middle to somewhere in that circle. It's, it's random where exactly it lands, but it will be somewhere in there. So we want to try and move our target from the middle circle over to one of the discovery recipes. And uh, as you can see, the first one I think we'll go for is on the right here, these uh, the hot wings. And I think we can get to it just by going over to the right twice. And yeah, just two pinches of black pepper and we land in that circle. Uh, if you don't already have the recipe discovered, it'll just have a big light blue shaded area in this quadrant. And you'll have to add recipes or add ingredients to land in that circle or to land somewhere in there and it'll kind of nudge you toward the exact location. But I've used, you know, sometimes with the expensive materials, I mean, sometimes you might have to drop 15, 20 gold just on discovering one low level recipe, which is not particularly fun. So, uh, as you can see, the two pinches of black pepper got us that recipe. And we'll go ahead and craft it. And we'll go ahead and try and hit the other one, too. And as I said, there's no guarantee here. I, I didn't buy a ridiculous amount of mats to, uh, to make sure that I hit it. But uh, hopefully we can do it. I, I think it looks like we can get the other one with a, a dollop of yogurt and a dash of citrus juice. So we'll, we'll try that. And indeed, we land right in it. So that got us this. It's not a guarantee that if you put those two ingredients, it will give you that recipe. But it seems like a, a pretty reasonable rate of success. Uh, if, you're, if you don't get it with those two ingredients, just try to make sure you land somewhere in that circle, and it will give it to you. So uh, that was the first two ingredients in cooking one. And then the next one is the jerky. And it brought up the submenu here, but the base one is the tough jerky. That's also in that texture recipe. And you'll have to get the two discoveries of spicy jerky and sweet jerky. And it takes tough meat. This one's actually really easy. I, I don't know how it is on everybody else's server, but uh, tough meat is pretty cheap on ours. And I believe these recipes are both easy to hit. And we'll start with the sweet jerky. I think. I think we can probably get to it with a. And also. I think because I leveled up mine at least a little bit that I may have access to more ingredients than other people. So I'll try to do it with the low level ones here. Uh, I think a pinch of cinnamon and a pinch of raw sugar. And indeed that lands us on the sweet jerky. And 
then for the spicy jerky, we'll do a pinch of cinnamon and a pinch of black pepper. And that one's pretty easy as well. Alright, so already with just those, we've landed all, all four that we've tried. And that would give us six out of the however many recipes it has in here. It doesn't actually tell me or not I've completed it. But uh, let's see, we started with the wings. We got the tangy wings, the zesty bug meat. Uh, and as you can see, it brings up, that's a sub one. And again, it brings up the fried bug meat base recipe, which you should already have. Or you can go find at a vendor. And uh, the variants are the zesty bug meat and the candy coated bugs. Try at that. And the zesty bug meat over here on the sour side. Um, I think we can get to it with a pinch of cheese. Oh, actually, we might not land this one. Uh, as you can see, the randomness of it, it landed a little high. And it's going to be kind of close. And maybe a dash of citrus juice, and it gives it to us. It had to be really close on the edge, but uh, apparently it says we hit it, so I will take it. And the candy-coated bugs, down and to the right. And it should be easy to hit, just a pinch of cinnamon and a pinch of raw sugar. And we land that. And that gives us the bug ones, the blackened fish fillet. Now I actually looked before I made this video and there was no small fish on the commodities exchange. I'm assuming it's pretty, pretty rare to find, or at least nobody farms it. But uh, so I'll at least give it one attempt. You can see where the crafting targets are. Uh, it looks like just two pinches of garlic would get us the blackened fish fillet. And I'll look at the other one. And probably two pinches of rock salt. Well, no. Maybe a pinch of cheese and a pinch of rock salt should get us the other one. It looks like those would both be pretty accurate. But uh, I'll just go ahead and pick one here. Well, I guess we'll do the, uh, what is it, the citrus fish fillet. And yeah, that lands us on that one. the yellow bells and it brings up the grilled yellow bell and our variants are the candied yellow bell and the stuffed yellow bell and we'll go ahead and try to hit the stuffed yellow bell first looks like two pinches of cheese and we land on that it looks like that does have a chance to fail but it should be for the most part it'll get it and then for the candied yellow bell I'm thinking a pinch of cinnamon and a pinch of raw sugar. Oh, maybe not. Oh, it gives it to us. I'll take it. I don't know. That one might just be... Alrighty, let's see what else we have. I think there might be one more, maybe two more. Yeah, the pomegranate smoothie. And the base one is the pomegranate punch. And we only have one discovery on this one. And it looks like maybe a dollop, dollop of yogurt and a pinch of raw sugar should do it. And I think that might be all of them for this one. We did the bug meat, we did the bug meat, that was the fish one, the yellow bells, and the fish fillet, yeah. So that's all of them for the uh, cooking one achievement. Uh, I think I'll split all these videos up and just sort them by achievement so it's a lot easier to find the one that you're looking for. Uh, I do plan on leveling this up. It is a time consuming skill to get up, so it might take me a while to put out the videos, but uh, if people haven't overwhelming uh, curiosity or urge to try and get certain recipes they can ask me and I'll I'll try and find it but uh, but yeah 
So hopefully that helps some people level up the cooking, which is a very, very difficult skill to level up. And thank you for watching, and good luck!